Two people were arraigned in court today in an animal cruelty case in North Kingstown. Thank you for joining us. I'm Chelsea Jones. I'm Mike Montecalvo. This case involves dozens of animals. 12 News reporter Adriana Rosas Rivera visited the RISPCA to get an update on the condition of those animals. Dozens of animals were rescued from a North Kingstown farm this week in an animal cruelty case. I visited the RISPCA in East Providence where some of them are being housed. Law enforcement officials found close to 70 animals on a farm in North Kingstown last Sunday. The RISPCA told me police responded to the home for a domestic violence incident and found around a dozen horses and donkeys, 10 dogs, 11 goats, and three to four dozen chickens and ducks. The goats are being cared for here at the RISPCA in East Providence. At least one of the goats has a broken leg, which is gonna have to be amputated. We expect that goat will do fine, most animals can do well on three legs. The RISPCA told me the animals had very little food and water. One of the horses was in such bad condition it had to be euthanized. Uh, the horse was literally skin and bones uh, and barely, barely standing uh, and clearly in distress. A veterinarian was also able to save another horse in poor condition. Salvatore Carfora, who owns the farm, and Sierra Cunningham were arraigned today on animal cruelty charges in the case. Cunningham also faces two domestic violence charges. The animals have all been put in foster care, and a veterinarian is monitoring them. Now, the RISPCA said that donations are always helpful in cases like this. We'll have their website linked on our website, WPRI.com. In the studio, I'm Adriana Rosas Rivera, 12 News.